everyone, so I'm making another video. The topic is interracial dating. And the, the video that kind of started this whole kind of, I guess, slight controversy on YouTube is a video that was supposed to be a documentary on interracial dating. And the response that I want to talk, to, uh, talk about is um, a response to the response to the documentary. It was by um, ahopki01 and I actually favorited her video. And I love her analogy, she said the, the best apple for you might be on a different tree. So it might be silly to not, to not keep your heart and your eyes open. I mean like we're tall, short, have different eye colors, different hair colors, different skin colors. It's just one factor amongst many and I mean for that you might as well date a painting because people are more than just how they look. Our clothes kind of indicate, I guess the style of our clothes kind of indicate who we are, but not all the time. And like, you have to get to know someone to know who they truly are. Some of the other responses I've noticed um, on this topic have said interracial relationships could create controversy. And I, I don't know how much it does that. I guess depending on where you live, it could. I think that sometimes it creates staring, which I wouldn't always assume that people have negative thoughts when they stare. Some people just do that and they shouldn't. I actually have brothers from Haiti who sometimes people stare and and sometimes they stare and when I smile they smile back. So it's just like they're just thinking. I don't know what they're thinking about but hey I mean I guess it's kind of like well why are you staring? It is a struggle. It is a challenge and my hope is that your relationship will be strong enough to overcome that challenge as long as well as other challenges that might come along. Because just because someone is of the same race or of a different race, it doesn't mean that they're the right person for you. So just make sure that you, regardless of what your challenges might be, even if you're not in an interracial relationship, make sure that you're committed to what's going on in your relationship and, and to the other person and to helping each other be the best versions of themselves, the best that they can be. That you're willing to overcome obstacles together as a team because I think that's kind of key. Those are my thoughts on the topic. Um, I'm kind of rambly right now so I'm going to have to cut and edit this. You can leave your comments on what you think about this whole issue. And that's, that's what I wanted to say and I hope you're all having a wonderful day and yeah okay bye.